What's up guys, my name is Alishan Nalai. In this video, I'm going to talk about TOF extension which you should, uh, you know, every React developers or every React Native developer should be, you know, you know, so top VS Code extension, I'm going to talk about that. So I'm, I'd already written one Medium article as well and also written one Excel draw as well. So the first, there's all the extension which can help you to make you much more productive. That can save you time as well, right? So what we're gonna see that we're gonna see that all this extension the name the first extension like which I'm gonna talk about like atom one dark theme uh, theme so if I show you the atom one dark theme this is how it looks like atom dark themes which I love it like you know I'm using this theme from the last five years okay and you can see like all the extension which I'm using let's uh, talk about like this here. The so first extension which I'm using that is called Atom One Dark Theme. So it doesn't, uh, you know, make a productivity in case. It's just a, a theme which I love it. Okay. So this is how it looks like. Okay. Now after the that the next extension extension is that Auto Close Tag. So Auto Close Tag is like you know whenever you write a code, it will automatically get closed. That uh, that will help as the Auto Close Tag. So make sure you also install this uh, extension. Now after that, uh, we are also using Auto Import. So auto import like you know give suggestion and automatically import that file if you're importing it and especially if you're working with react or react native it will save you tons of time or like if you're working with any kind of project so you usually do import okay so it will do the auto import or it will give you some suggestion after that we having a, another extension that is called auto rename tag so let's suppose if you're renaming the p tag with the b tag or like with let's suppose you are uh, just you know so if what is going to do it will uh, you know rename the uh, closing tag as well let's suppose if i'm just editing this tag so it will also edit the closing tag as well so you don't have to again edit it now the next extension which i'm talking about that is called bracket pair uh, delivery okay so every uh, bracket pair will be uh, you know make a one color so it will gonna save you time as well for the debugging and you know you know which bracket like you know which is closing and which is opening after that we have another extension which and which we use a lot extension and one of the most important extensions that is called es7 uh, plus react redux react Native extension you should guys use and like i um, also use it and let me show you this example of this as well uh, this extension so they are telling that if you just press r and f e s so if i show you that example here so let's suppose if i close this file and here if i just type r and F E S. Okay, so what is going to do? It will create a React Native default functional export along with the style sheet. Let's suppose if you're using React and you want to make a arrow function component quickly, so what you have to write, you have to just write R A F C E. All right, so it will create a quickly a component and it can save a uh, tons of time. All right. Now let's move to the next extension that is called ESLint. So what is linting? Like you know, ESLint suggests you to write the code much more cleaner way okay so let's suppose if you're writing a code and it will like throw a error or it will make a red warning kind of error on the runtime so it will also save you time and uh, it can save you you know coming uh, to the new error now git lands let's talk about the git lands git lands are usually a lot so you know git lands you, you know if you have you if you're using git lands and you you are using git so it will show you that you know what was the last commit or if you just over it error all the things so that gonna save you a lot of times okay after that we have another extension that is called material icon theme so if you see that the icons looking are too awesome right just because of this material icon theme extension okay now after that we are having another extension that is called path intelligence so if you're writing a path so it will give you intelligence of the file path okay like as you can see that on this example he is getting the suggestion so just because of path intelligence all right now another extension that is called prettier prettier are used to the prettify the code if you're writing a code and it doesn't format so pretty help you to write the format of prettier code okay now after that we are having a react native tools uh, it will have a like you know it can also save you time if you're using react native so you can see that the bs code extension for a development environment for react native project using that you can debug your code uh, run react native commands from the command palette all right so you can debug your code and do all the things and it can so saves you a lot of times now the next last extension which i'm talking about that is called tailwind css so if you're using tailwind css so it will suggest you the you know uh, tailwind code as well 
Now after that, you can also like you know spell. Uh, there's much more extension like this called spell character kind of. So what is gonna like it will check that spelling is correct or not. Let's suppose if you're writing a function or if you're writing any spelling like you know the first value. So it it, it can show that it's not correct. So you can also uh, you know correct that as well. All right. So yeah, that's all in this video, guys. And here I will provide the list of uh, you know extension name. You guys can also add on the comment section if I forget any extension. And here I written the uh, you know more article, so which you can guys check it out. So yeah, that's all in this video. Uh, this extension can help you to you know make your product to the next level. That's why I'm recommending and recommending to you guys. And I'm also using from the last five years, and it saves a lot of times for me. All right. Yeah. Thanks all. Thank you. Bye.